Loser doesn't make worlds. So, yeah, whoever loses this series is out of the LPL playoffs and out of worlds. You're, you're over for the, the entire year, whoever loses. Derry, Kennan, Poppy, Azir, Silas, Kalista. Sejuani first pick. Are they first picking Sejuani away from the Shy? Huh? I think they can just pick Aphelios Gwen. Oh, they're on 1215. I think Aphelios well, I think is so thick. Does LPL teams like Wukong? Oh, they like Vi. Okay, well. Um, you could play Draven. You could play Lucian Nami. You could play uh, Wukong here and go mid. Just kind of be Wukong, uh, Wukong is serious. Wukong can't do it. Lucian Nami. He needs to pick top on three. Yeah, I, think I think there's enough support. They should just pick top. Pick whatever's good. Yeah, Gwen, if you want to play Gwen in Sejuani, it's good. Yeah, Gwen's fine. They have so many supports. They have Nautilus, Leona, Renata, Lulu, Yoraban. Oh, they're scared of the Sejuani flex. They're, ca they're scared of Sejuani flex. The Tarzan, and then it's Fiora top into Gwen. Jax as well. Yeah, Jax as well. Okay, I get it. I get it. They ban Ari. This draft is going really quick. I think they should pick support on three. I think LeBlanc on five can work. They don't have great team fight, but maybe if they get Renata on four or Lulu on four, they'll get better team fight. Yeah, not as spent. I think you have Leona, Lulu, Renata. It's basically your options. I think Renata's hard into this. I don't know if I'm wrong. Yeah, Lulu's good. Lulu's always picked into Lucian Nami. Yeah, there's a lot of options here. They can swap the Sejuani jungle, pick double solo lane. They can pick uh, Wukong in a mid that can dive. Akali. Okay, Akali's going to Gwen. So this could be Akali top still. Depends on their last pick. If they pick Corky here, could be um, Akali top. Could also be Akali mid. Still, I think it's going to be Sejuani jungle actually. Renekton. Oh, it's good. Oh, they double flex solo lanes. Oh, they have double flex. Sejuani jungle. I think they're going LeBlanc on five. It's the best option. Even from three pick, I think LeBlanc on five is best. Galios. Okay. Lissandra's fine as well. They have Renekton Akali. So it is Renekton mid, actually. Yeah, I thought so. Holy fuck. It's going to be Renekton mid. Oh, they're playing Renekton Sejuani mid jungle. Actually, it's good into Vi. Like, Vi plus Lissandra plus or Vi plus Ari is normally a really strong mid jungle, but I actually think Renekton Sejuani wins that pretty hard. I think Vi just gets one shot by running from Sejuani. I like uh, LNG's comp, but I'm like, everyone has, like drafts can be subjective. The way the game can be played is slightly subjective, has a little bit of wiggle room. And uh, it all comes down to your players, but like Lucian Nami, Renek and Sejuani, <laughs> if you don't win early, then of course you're fucked against the Filios, Lulu, Lissandra, right? Actually skill matchups everywhere, I know. There's no Sejuani Orn. It's Gwen versus, Gwen versus Akali, Lulu Nami lane, which is also quite skilled in getting the push. And Renekton and mid. It's actually a banger. Akali hard stomps Gwen. No, I think Gwen wins level 1 to 6. Gwen can win and get the push until 6 from what I've seen. But uh, after 6, Akali has a lot of kill pressure. Hey guys, it's Kajal. Uh, I'm going to be pumping out loads of YouTube content. But I noticed that a lot of you aren't subscribed. There's going to be a graphic somewhere. Maybe my editor puts it up. Uh, but if you could subscribe, it really helps. Uh, I really appreciate all the support on the videos recently. I'll try to be covering all the uh, major regions across the world as much as I can. And uh, yeah, thanks again for watching the videos. Enjoy! Bitch! Said you want a jungle. Wow, it's been a while, huh? Why is Rennington back in pro play? Well, uh, Rennington got buffed and a lot of the top laners around him got nerfed. Like, Nara got nerfed, Chippy got nerfed. Uh, Gwen got, I think, on, did she get nerfed on 12-15 a bit? Very quickly and um, so a lot of the top laners around him got nerfed. The way the way metas work is it's not like this, these champs are buffed, these champs are nerfed, the meta swaps, no. It's also like these champs are good, but these champs are S tier, but the S tier champs are nerfed, so now these champs are better. So then it makes other champs rise up, you know. The Renekton was like an A tier champ, and then obviously when the, the S tiers get nerfed, then Renekton is now in the S tier category because everything gets taken down. Ah, uh, flash it onto the shy. The ignite comes down. He doesn't have a flash. This is literally going to be a kill coming out here because he just wasn't looking at his character. I can't walk into river. Rennington. Rennington says Juani will just one shot him. Oh wait, Rennington diving top. But Tarzan looks like he will try and make something happen. Oh my god. Fringe jungle mid rolls. 
Not really looking like he's going to be too long for this world, but they will have the perks execution. execution. Yeah, Cancelled by Akali E. Uh -oh. He's stopped between a rock and a hard place. He's trying to go in, but I don't think he's going to have... Where's his team at? And he will be taken Where's his team? out. Really good role. Can we cross map, doing? guys? He Hello? Making this Renekton early game work Mid so no well. push. And it's so good Gungle to never see topside. Look, he'll be up in CS after that wave as well. Fucking mid jungle, man. Yeah, we got Drake for it. Not bad. I still have six. But it's hard for him to kill anyone, really. I guess Renekton could die. You have Ignite mid. We're gonna fight Herald. I mean, LNG's Herald fight is bonkers. What are these cringe kids doing? Oh my god. Oh, it's fucking open, man. It's fucking open. It's the wrong side of the Shy. Oh. Hang on. I mean, they're gonna try and push him out. And it looks like Allah just stayed a little bit too far forward. They're gonna try and jump now on top of SOFM, who should be stunned in and traded back. So yes, you killed. Renekton said you want him, baby. Yeah, they have Herald. It's probably gonna go top by the looks of it. I don't know. No one is everyone is just going top. I, I can tell you in the in their draft meeting and in their pre-game meeting, everyone was saying that they're just gonna gank top. In LNG, they found the internet to shout. Oh my god! And we get a jungler top on my team. Sometimes he give it, sometimes he take it. Via life, ping, ping, ping. They should be able to get Drake as well. LNG. They have a play of the Rune King, Renekton at minute ten. So I mean, this guy is just gonna one shot everyone. Why does he stay? on the tower. They got the, the, the a couple of the deaths were his fault, but a couple of the deaths, there was really not much he can do. Like, that one was definitely his fault. The one walking the Herald, definitely his fault. But the two when his wave was pushing out, maybe not his fault. I mean, it even didn't Doin B say on his stream that the Shy is, like, really insane, but he dies to every gank. So he just told his team, yeah, I'm roaming top every wave. Ah, look, he can't leave his tower. Look, he just presses S. I mean, There's nothing to do. He just press S. Nothing to do. <laughs> Fucking shit, jungle mid. I think he's tilted as fuck, actually. I don't know why. But I do know why, because 0-5. But just the fact that he presses S. You know when a pro player presses S and just stands still? That they're tilted. It's their way of showing in a body language that they can't do anything. The worst thing... He's terrible, but in not pro in play, area. it's when one lane is feeding, or like they're dying to random ganks, and the ABL, only so thing they do is they do... <sighs> they just sigh really loud down the mic once. That's when you know the game is completely <laughs> fucking like, lost. Hey, the show, and they're not even cross-mapping top. Fight. Their wave is just stacking Ola, into the tower. They so don't have a TP either, so they have to fight this. Pog, let's go, they don't really have an option. Either try to fight it or fight it, but they can't go top. And I think Ale can TP top and catch the wave after this objective. It's a horror. Don't be TPing mid. You just TP for two range creeps. <laughs> Why did you take? I know that Weibo's game plan next game is put SOFM on Trundle or something that can level two gank and just run top level two. Or invade top side level two. Weibo, they're just backing themselves away. That being said, though, they TP the angel down towards his bot side. They're looking to try and collapse onto Ala and Doonby. That's impossible. You gotta be so careful with this. They're just gonna die. So much onto the Renekton, who's got himself an ultimate, and he's just so tanky. He won't go down. And Angel, you TP'd in for nothing. That's two more kills for the Akali, and the AOE slow of the Glacial Prison is just massive. How broken is Renekton? Holy fuck! This guy just tanked the full Lissandra combo twice with ult and Vi combo and then just turned around and one shot the Vi. Look, W, Q. Ever Frost, Q, Vile, Red Smite, E, Auto, W proc, they just one shots the Vi. This is what the Shy will say after their game. You should jungle less and gank top more. And then they'll be fine. On, almost taken out. The tidal wave's gonna be trying to disengage there from light, but he gets taken oh, out. Oh, first kill for the shine. Nice kill here coming out here for LNG. Or sorry, for oh, Wade. you're so cringe, lucky. They're gonna jump back onto the, the shy's one before and he killed one. Doombi is one v four on the backside and coming out. What was SFM's pathing this game? He did Raptors red. Uh, Wolf's blue grump bot crab, but and already by the time he did crab, was the shy dead? Exactly 
you're gonna try and get on I mean, like priority. that. This is the person you need to try and oh, kill. Oh, nice. That's a kill. Will shut him down. That's a lot of gold. That is pretty huge. Can they get mid tier one actually? And top tier one? Wait, this is pretty big for Weibo. This is really big. They have objective bounties. They have bot tier ones and objective bounty. Mid tier ones and objective bounty. And they're both really low towers. Can they get mid and bot tower? Like even just on a push? They're gonna get bot tier one as well. Nice. Hey, just push, 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 Angel. Just take it. Just take it. What LNG are Yo! How quickly just take it! Push this game forward, but I think with uh, the Lucian's now, showing mid, Renekton's showing top. Yes. Taking two because we did all that hard work for Allah. Oh, that's oh, where he is go, in man. now, though. LNG are getting a little bit complacent, oh. as we can see now. Five members of Weibo. Wow, that's huge. Side, and I love this from Weibo, that's a big pick. That's two shutdowns on the solo lanes. Another big pick. Yeah, Weibo needs to play for picks, but now they don't don't have Angel TP, but they can play on Angel's lane, so they can play on top now with Shy TP. But the Shy is level 13, and the uh, enemy Akali is level 16, so they need more time. They need a lot more time. He's level 14 now, not bad. He needs to push bot, he needs to push the next wave, just keep pushing. Renekton will show mid in a sec, he might be hesitant now, but when he sees Renekton, he can just go back to bot, but it looks like he's in a group. LNG's next objective will be top tier too. So making top plays is hard, because they'll be matching. Your best thanks to them. Oh. Alright, so Femme is Greek, this Kiri is dead. You have stop watch? Oh my god, this Nash is gone. Oh, what? Oh, what the fuck? The Shy is psychotic, man. That's really unlucky they didn't get anyone there. Alright, it's over. They're gonna be they gonna get dragon? Say, yeah, they'll get dragon. Not too shabby. Objective up. bounty. Like Loser fire. doesn't make worlds. So, yeah, the whoever the loses this series is out of the LPL playoffs and out of worlds. You're you're over for the, over for the, the entire year. Whoever loses. LPL LPL playoffs format is brutal. You guys think Weibo and NG are like? If you haven't watched LPL or near the top, they're really not. There's Tess, JDG, uh, V5, RNG, um. His job is to keep his EG. Got two more I think then it's Weibo, then it's Weibo and LNG. That's basically what the playoffs are like right now. So these two are playing each other. These two will play each other tomorrow. And then I think V5 will play the winner of this series. It's, it's complicated. I liked this Renekton. Look at Tarsan's build. What? Is he playing with um, Ingen Ingenious Hunter? Hello, Mr. Dot Streamer. Thanks for the great content. I really like LNG's draft. First pick Sejuani, make them third pick top, counter pick Gwen with Akali, put Sejuani mid and, and put Renekton into Lissandra. Actually really good. Wait, Weibo's red side. What? They're going to do the same bends? Yeah, it's going to be Sejuani first pick again, isn't it? Here comes Aphelios. I bet you they don't pick Vi. I bet you they don't pick Vi. Jungle less gank top more. Yeah, I told I just you. Hope that we do get on onto something Maybe they'll get Vi on 3 though, actually. Ari's good. They'll go Lucian Nami. Maybe they drop top now and just pick Vi here. And they're going to put the Shy on Orn. I can feel it. I can feel it. I can feel it. I can feel it. They'll pick Vi. And then he'll pick Orn on 5. They should probably ban Orn, actually. Yeah, at least you'll be able to ban away or oh, Nautilus. Well, okay, they're doing the Fiora bans again. They'll ban Nautilus Orn. I think they should ban Nautilus Orn. They're gonna ban Jax. They ban Jax, and they're probably picking Gwen. Gwen ban. Renekton ban is not bad, but I think they're banning their own champ. They should pick support. Yeah, Lulu's fine. They need some melee champs for the Sejuani. What melee champs can they pick? They must have some prepared. I'm just not again a big. They said you only first pick. Yone? Holy fuck. Is that Doin B Yone? Of Weibo's early game. They need, a, they need another mini champ. Or is it said you want top? Jax, yeah, they're picking Orn. Jesus Christ. Yone, Jax. Actually, yeah, it's obvious, isn't it? When they ban Renekton, they will blind Jax. They have no AP against Orn Viari. So LNG is playing quite a psycho comp. Your champs are full AD in a sense, right? You have Sejuani Nami, which is quite nice to make them build play the steel caps, which means your CC is longer exactly and stuff like that, right? And uh, he actually doesn't run uh, Ingenious Hunter when he goes Redemption on Sejuani. He goes Redemption on a lot of champs, this guy. 
He's been doing it for many years. Uh, but anyway, they have really insane one three one. Really insane one three one, and they have. I mean, it's it's these are the kind of champs like you know Silas, Yasuo, Yone, Jax, Camille, Fiora. These are the kind of champs which just have skill expression, right? The way you, we can look at it, it's just ease of execution, right? These two champs will just press R on Yone with an Ornold behind them, and he will die. But can Yone outplay it, right? Can he like ult the Vild? The Shy Slain is good so far. Much, much more stable. His Gwen is not zero, t zero two already. So we take those. Yo, Esmac, here's my prank. Oh, thanks, bro. Oh, nice engage. Can they chain CC? Oh my god, insane chain CC. There's just skill expression, baby. Oh, E flash as well. Can they chase with the ward? No, they're going on the shy. No flash. Nice stun on here with ult. Can they maybe turn this? No, they can't. They don't have damage. Oh, Vi went in. Big. Oh, they do have damage. Holy fuck. The shy will die. Oh my god, in comes a fucking wave. Oh my god, is LNG gonna 3-0 them? Quadra kill for Toynbee? It was a Quadra? It was a delayed Quadra. Ah, okay. Oh yeah, 4 0, zero. Dude, every single game I see Yone in Herald fights, he's just smashing everyone. Why? Like, this is this champ just fucking broken? Every Herald fight, this, this champ is just carrying. I mean, Angel just got chained cc into death. Oh my god, Jaxxin. He's dead, actually. He's dead. He has lethal tempo and Q in 5. Oh my good god. Uh, this game is super fucked for Weibo. There's no way Weibo is just gonna get 3 0'd, man. No! Uh, it's, a, it's an insane engage on Angel. Full chain CC. Is, is Doin be dead? No, Tarzan's there. Or maybe. Oh, Hong Kong. Nice Gale Force. Can they get Tarzan down? Oh, they got Tarzan. And that's going to be a trade back here. Okay, not the worst. Toynbee has a big shutdown, but you take what you can get. I don't think the Shy can stop him. He would just die. He might have to ult here, actually. Oh my god, he's dead. You don't put the Shy on tanks. It's true. This guy will just grief it, man. Oh my god, he has a 0% win rate on tanks. <laughs> <laughs> so the winner of this will face V5. That's why we need the Shy to win. So he can face Rookie and knock him out. But at this rate, I mean, the Shy is playing like a fucking bronzy. <laughs> He's just tied to everything. But instead, we're seeing that's not the case in the Shy. Oh, actually, Angel. Oh, Angel, he has got the mobility, but can he get himself Blade right? That's so much damage. It's going to be a fight on the top side, though. It's 1v1 and a 3v3. Nice we can see them going in. SOFM is so low, and he's taken out. Angel has a, he has has flash, a flash TP out. Over the wall, but he Weibo scales a lot better. No flash on SOFM, no flash on Angel. It's going to be on Huan Fong to do the real damage, but he's already getting poked out. That rapid fire cannon, that extra little bit of range is doing well. Oh, this game's They're going to jump here. in onto Huan Fong. There's the call of the but a completely whiffed tidal wave across the rest of the team, and Weibo are scattered to oh, the wind. They don't know where they want to be. He's and to their bot Angel's dead as well. This comp wouldn't work in Europe, for example, because uh, it can look quite embarrassing playing this comp with Yone Jax if you fall behind against Orn and they force Drake, so you'll just lose the game really quick. Weibo's 5v5 is good, but they're way too far behind. I think the only team in EU that could pull out this comp from LNG is probably G2. Is this the best comp in the meta right now? No, I think this is just their approach on the game. Like, everyone's approach on the game can be subjective. There can be correct ways to play the game in terms of draft, like on S-tier picks, but you can always break the meta as well. It seems like Sejuani jungle is their way of breaking the meta because it makes you able to play double booster AD solo lanes, which is doing this speciality and Ale speciality. Yeah, so he goes... He goes they first pick Sejuani, flex it worst case on blue side, and then he builds um, Fist, Knight's Vow, and then he goes Redemption, but normally on Olaf you used to build Redemption, but you used to go Ingenious Hunter Olaf with Predator and Redemption and Cookies, and that was 2018 I think. And it was good, but the shy still, uh, the Tarzan still loves it. Oh my god, that ult was sick. Was that? That was blind. Ah, oh, they will just kill the shy. This guy's dead. Like there's, oh he missed his ult. Oh my god, the shy. <laughs> he missed his ult as well. Wait, the bot lane is dead as well. Yo, cameraman. Oh man. Yeah, here it is. I saw him playing it in 20, uh, 2019 playoffs. Tarzan would play Predator Olaf with Redemption. He always used to do this Redemption, and he would go Ingenious Hunter. 
Do you think people so it means that your cooldown is lower with Cosmic Insight as well. Like LS who visually mauled during drafts. Champion was... And he still does it three years later. Even without Ingenious Hunter. Maybe he thinks Redemption is just a broken item. Oh, he got flipped in his jump. And again, similar to game one, we are seeing a couple of mid game decisions. Uh, what did you say, sorry? SFM did that stuff, yeah. A few junglers are doing it. They might not need to because the bubble lands, the tidal wave is good. And look about picks up a kill now. Doing me, yeah, he's tanky. Yeah. Oh, light. Yeah, he's gonna flash over. Yeah. It's a 24 minute stump. If he dies to every gank, it's jungle diff. If he dies 1v1, it's because of jungle diff earlier on in draft. If he loses the game solo and he gets 3 0 caster diff. <laughs> it's never the shy's fault. <laughs> Holy. Derry first pick. They banned Sejuani and chose blue side. Okay, we're progressing. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Reddington first pick. Jesus. Oh my good god. I hope you have a good answer. If it's Lucian Nami, I'm sad. If it's Draven Nautilus, or. If it's a Filios Lulu, mm, just go full top side. Vi Ari would, would not would not mind the Vi Ari. Actually, no, don't let SFM play Vi, please. Don't let SFM play Vi, please. I don't want to see a third game of Vi. It's enough. I've seen enough. Oh, thank fucking god. Hey, Tarzan could pick Vi himself now, or they could match top with Orn. This time around, so or very easy go Trundles. I don't really like Trundle like that much. That I have a feeling that that Scion might go mid. I have a feeling that that Scion might go mid. Are they going to play Senna Tam? Senna Yasuo, what? That was crazy. Out of nowhere. Tarzan level 2 gank pot. Oh god, this is going to go so horrible. That Senna is just so fucking dead. That Senna is so fucking dead. That Senna is so fucking dead. Wait, does he not have pillar? They're gonna jump down on top of Juan Fung. Doesn't matter. He's got nowhere to go, nowhere to be. For Quite able to get the knock up there from on. And you can see now Tarzan gonna get jumped on here by SOFM. Yeah, SOFM can't really say, punish this. He needs Grump though, right Tarzan, to level up. Gonna be an easy one to try and Maybe they can force this a bit more. Okay, the Shy is smashing lane, and jungle hasn't come top yet. I think the Scion can just build full armor and buy an Atomus and put it on Ari. I think that would be ideal. Frozen Heart. Maybe he could go Sunfire or Gauntlet. And then an Atomus or something. They're gonna get Herald, that's good. Weibo's first Herald, about fucking time. Yeah, bot push. This is kind of dangerous though. They're gonna jump down on top of On, who has nowhere to go! Yasuo, I guess. Nowhere to be! And On, you may have played Maybe he can live actually. Yasuo, but you're he flashes to the wave, but I can't. Here. Tarzan will get him down. Gary has tier 2 boots as well. And that just comes from the proactivity of the oh, holy. And again, holy Tarzan. I don't know if this Yasuo of Senna lane will be useful, but... I'll stay tuned just in case. Hey, Seville, can you tell Dale to unban me? I got banned for saying minus one while he was offline. <laughs> Maybe you should tell one of his mods. I'm gonna hold Fung's dead. Tarzan with another kill to his Talia flash in though from SOFM. The Cyclone comes out, they do get the last breath. That's a good win wall. Oh, Lamal got interrupted on this W. Tarzan almost survived. Oh, Doinby. Eventually he does go oh, down to another 3v3 in the bottom. Oh, Doinby. Oh, Doinby. On top of SOFM as he falls. Now Angel with one last pick. Angel, you can make some magic here, baby. You can make some magic here. Triple kill. Let's go, Angel! Let's go! It's about fucking time! Better late than never. Oh, the exhaust on Yasuo was sick, but Lamal got interrupted here, got knocked up so he couldn't W. But then Doimbi carries a bit here. His E went onto the clone, I think, which sucks, but uh, Angel carried. This Q on Doimbi won them the fight. Two damage, baby. That's the second one, trying to they need to secure Drake. Ari just needs to flash push mid. She doesn't have ult, but it'll be up for Drake. The darks, when the Shy gets blade as well, the Scion's gonna get fisted. Ari's doing damage right now. We do see the smite coming out from Tarzan. We'll have another one in about 15 seconds. But here comes the Cyclone. No flash. Back out onto the map. And they're just nice one shot. Straight down these I remember I had, uh, I was playing with Expect on a team. And he was like playing Renekton into something. I think it was like Renekton into Jace. And he died like four times in the first seven minutes. And we were reviewing the game in scrims. And we were like, how did you die first four times in seven minutes? And he said, well, if he hits me, I have to hit him. 
If I don't hit him, then I can't play my lane. So when he hits me, I hit him and then I die. So I said, you know what? Okay. I feel like that's top lane mentality. If he hits me, I hit him. If, if I hit him, he hits me. <laughs> you can't give him a free auto attack. It's just how it is. Oh, yes, Blade now. Uh, Scion's gonna lose really hard. SOFM not on Vi. Winnable. We'll be able to try and trade this one back. Oh, he flashed into the wall. The flash. He does get it over the wall, though, as we can see the center just finally finishing that one off. With okay, Shadow. okay. And this is Maybe Weibo win this one. Hey, it's a reverse the sweep. The dream is alive. Into a good spot. Who you and got no for playoff final neck? Uh, match G2 maybe? What the fuck is that champ? Maybe the dream is dead. I don't know. Every time I see Zeri Yumi on the screen. It's balanced. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, he's dead again. Like, what is he doing, man? Oh my god. Oh no! He got the cannon. Like, the Shy is griefing. Two games in a row and bot lane plays good. The one time the Shy is playing good, bot lane is now griefing. Like, can one side, can both sides just play fine? The Shy has zero kills and zero deaths in 21 minutes. Something's wrong here. Something's really wrong. I think SOFM could go Black Cleaver this game. It's not too bad. I ulted. He might go on Doinby, actually. It's a flip, it's a flip. Oh, they got it. There it's, yeah, they're going to Kali. Oh my god, he's one shot. Doinby is instantly killed. Yeah, GG, I think the game's over. They did have to ban five top laners. So I'm a bit worried about when LNG choose blue side and then two, three Fiora or Jax. I think the Shy needs to find a carry that he can pick. I think Renekton is the carry. He needs to pick on three. When they are blue side and they first pick AD or something, and then they just pick like Fiora or Jax here, he needs to be able to pick Renekton on three. I wonder if they blue side ban Renekton if they ban Sejuani. It'd be a bit of a interesting draft. Maybe LNG even first pick Renekton and flex it on blue side. Does a similar job to Sejuani, flexing top jungle. Hmm. Oh, it's going to be a hard draft for Weibo in game four. It's going to be a really hard draft. The Shy is getting four men. Oh, it's pretty clean. They have stopwatch. Nope. Alright, Angel's TP got cancelled by Sion. It sucks. Does Sion die for it? No, he doesn't. Just take jungle camps and wait for next fight. We'll be around Elder, I presume. Oh, I think Zeri might carry. The problem he has is uh, one Wukong knock up and he's dead. Like, there's so much follow up. Rennington Flash will be up. Yasuo will be ulting on the Wukong. Ari can gap close. Sen ult. That's so much that he has to deal with the second he gets knocked up. But if he can dodge the Wukong knock up, maybe Zeri can carry. Oh, they're making a pick. Oh my god, what is that? That's gonna be another kill going over to light. I don't think they can get anything for this. There's still one minute till Drake and they have TP, so they can't do anything with it. It's just a kill. Blimby's actually pretty strong as well. He just got Void Staff. 30 seconds on Drake. I think LNG actually have a small chance. They have Mikhail's QSS, Sums on Zeri, ult up, three items and a BF. They have to go through mid, but I think they have time to go through mid. Where's Angel? Is he in the tribush? Oh, Angel. Light is 1 HP. Oh, let's fuck. That's over. Angel's playing really well. Oh, Angel. Angel's playing really well. They'll get Elder Nash and they'll have Soul. Yeah, oh, the Shy. Nice QSS. Yeah, bye-bye. Weibo finds an opportunity. They get all the buffs they can possibly need, and they keep themselves alive. They're gonna have to change the Zeri ban, I think. It's gonna have to be Kennen, Poppy, Sejuani. But then I think they'll first pick Renekton. If they don't first pick Renekton, and they first pick Zeri, that's actually good. Because you can play your Senna lane or an Aphelios lane, and you can pick Renekton on 3, or Renekton on 1-2 with Ari. 
I don't know. It's going to be a hard draft. It's going to be a really hard draft for Weibo. So it's LNG who banned Renekton, and it's Weibo, but the Renekton ban tells me that they're early rotating a Jax Fiora, so I hope they have something ready. Yeah, okay. So they actually learned pretty well. There's the Zeri first pick, expected. I don't like the Yasuo lane, I don't like the, 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 the Lucian lane, I like the Wukong, it worked last game. Lucian Nami is fine. I'm just scared of if they do Yumi here and then pick Jax or something blind, so what's your picking on three? Because they can force your hand here. I already think they should just force a top lane pick here. But Alessior is banned, this was a really good ban. I guess the only thing he has is Jax. Uh, Chandel is the safest. That's really good because that allows them to do Nami on three. So it's fine for Weibo, this is actually fine for Weibo. They, their draft is not exactly better, but they had a lot of holes in their draft that could be abused by uh, LNG by the last three games. Now, Orin is not great for Weibo because they're playing Trundle, obviously, but it's pretty good for LNG when they're playing Zero Yumi. Unless the Shy has a counter on 5, I think they should ban it. I mean, they have an easy Ari on 4 here, which should probably be banned. But they banned Jax. They didn't actually have a Jax response. I really think LNG can just slam Jax here, and they have to either sacrifice the Nami, or they have to pull out some kind of Jace lane. I don't know, or just pick Orin. I don't know. Again, but that didn't go very well. They have to ban Ari. I mean, the Ari still open. I feel like they have to ban Orn as well. LNG, but still got a lot of options here for and then they can ban the Blanc yeah, too. Silas as well. Perhaps the Azir. Azir has been and then what are they blind mid Azir? And then they'll play Akali or something. You have two yeah, options here, LeBlanc or Silas. I, I guess if they pick LeBlanc, they can go list, so that's fine. So, Gwen is OP right now, like Azir is OP right now. Uh, what else did I say? I forgot. Orin is OP right now. Yeah, they're gonna take Gwen. Mm, I think they should just blind the Kali mid though. I think LeBlanc blind is terrible. If they blind the Kali, what does Angel pick? Yeah, Azir. We'll Azir comes out here. I don't we'll really like Azir, Azir much when you have Gwen Wukong. I think Azir here Sharon is fine if you pick a tank top. Alright, sure slow game. This will be a slower uh, game. Unless Tarzan does some psycho shit. Is he just gonna gank top? Form. Three camps gank top? Please don't. Three camps gank top. Please, 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 please. Weibo have really good wards actually on both entrances. Oh! Yumi's dead! The fact that they didn't want to go for this because one small mistake could oh, mean no. the end of your oh, series. No. Lumao flashes in, he gets himself back into the Zeri now. On has nowhere top side. A top gank Alan, for Shy. No, and overextended. This is so dangerous. It's so so dangerous. He will have a hop and a flash. He might be able to get himself away. The little bit of a slow. The flash forward. One more auto attack, but no, no. So bad. Cool you come top to once Allah, in the entire balls, series, and, and that's what you do. Your first top gank of the series. Event, right? going to be able to bully. Not too bad for Weibo. Game is fine. If SOFM just didn't die top, the game would be really fine. Mercs only for bubble? No. The base MR on Mercs is quite nice, especially when you're against double, a uh, double AP solo lanes. You'll always be matching one, so the MR is nice. You can see that's very difficult for them to make things work. Nice, SOFM. Thank you. Come on, Weibo. Let's go. 3-0. They lost two Herald, though. Well they need to start Drake now. You yeah. the hat and off he goes. But now, Ala recognizes that he might be in a 1v1 here on the top side. And you can see now, ooh, the ult doesn't quite oh, hit anybody. You can see Light trying to get stacked up here. They're going to go for a flip. And it's LNG who secure it. Now, SOFM has nice to come himself over the, on the wall. E2. There's going to be the Azir Emperor's Divide. He has to eat the Krugs, but he's dead, I think. Back into a decent position. SOFM running as far as he possibly can. But the W lands, which means that he's slowed down. His SOFM is here, but he has been spotted. So Light should be able to keep his dash over the wall oh. to himself. Now, Angel trying to see if he can run away. Nice but, push. Uh, ooh, the Shuriken oh, Angel. Land, oh, what the fuck? Angel! Angel! He's able to kind of turn this one around. Oh. But he puts himself with... Soul. They're gonna Herald for tier 2, because I know he's on Drake, he's yeah, it's cool. not bad, they don't have TPs, that's the problem, so when Angel shows in his bot tier 1, they know they can so just cross map, Huang Fang and On need to run top right now, they're so soxy to tier 1, if they don't, this, ta this tower is dead, Angel's going to Grump, so they can't even take a bot tier 1, alright, they're gonna lose 2 towers, if LNG keep going, they're not gonna keep going, I think they could though, they just lost track of Azir, oh nice play by the try, okie doke, well, nothing Sorry, will happen until Drake, really. Like Ali will get Sonyas in base after top wave. Ali has bot push sure against the Shy. The so I don't know what the Shy's item is. I think he's trying to go void staff next Both because he has mercs. They're Drake in 50. Big team fight inbound. Not much anyway, else to do. Is the Shy fine? He looks fine. Has joined us in this fight as the Shy 
Yeah, it's sadly for him, he's not really going to have that ball worst pressure case. or even the side lane pressure against Zala because Zala in that well. mid They could probably just drop the strike and play for mid-tier 1, put a tower and then keep pushing. Spike right now. If they have a top wave to move into, oh, what a nice chunk. Needs to be very careful. Has to pop oh, they got, they got trundled. That's pretty big. They could just push mid here and drop Drake and get mid tier 1. I think that's their best option right now. Oh, that is such a nutcase. Look at him. Weibo to LNG. That being said, though, LNG aren't dropping mid waves, they're not even starting Drake. It's smart. Really they don't want to let them yet. take this tower. Okay, so Weibo actually have to push through mid now, which is good. I think he's gonna have to TP in. I don't know, he can't really walk into his jungle blind. There could be an Akali in an R. Nami's basing because she's run out of wards. Looks like they're just giving it. He needs to do something top then. Engage needs to run top really soon. There's engaging. Oh, he got cancelled by Trundle. Oh, Dornby. Oh, Dornby will carry here if he goes on his ear. On the side of this Ow. one here, Doombie only had eyes oh, for one man. Never mind, he had him for two. He got Hello? greedy and ate all of his cake as well. Nash? So Weibo lose two out of nowhere. Angel the fucking ran it there. I think he tried to gap close onto Zeri because of her flash towards him, but Trundle blocked his WE. Member. Keep away right no! no really kind of go into this. And, yeah, and they lost top waves. Up. I mean, look, for the yeah, shy pack rip bozo. Yo, don't smoke the pack yet. His, uh, don't smoke the pack yet. Chill out. Down. He's don't not really don't smoke. Don't smoke the pack yet. Final chapter and the ultimate out of Zeri. So oh, oh yeah, He's you so can light it up. You can light it up. How is that a it gets if well, we'll Zeri is not either go, nerfed really or removed before Worlds, I will be extremely sad if I have to watch Zeri at Worlds. Just go bring it's such a fucking hit champ. Absolutely absurd. Oh, please, please, please. Someone clutch it. Come on, please. The shy. Come on, Super Saiyan. Uh, Huang Fang, get IE and just one-shot everyone, please. Game five. Because the shy, the shy who are in heaven. Ale! Yes, Ale! The prages are being answered! It's a griefer! Mistake actually cost him his life, and maybe the keep praging, keep praging, keep praging. But that's just so much damage from doing B. He will go into stasis. They're trying to keep the shy away. He flashes in as Anz underneath the tower to double kill. The him. Shy. It's gonna be the shy going down, and despite Allah going no, over, no, bad, no, bad, no, bad, no, bad, no, bad, no, 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 and stop it, stop it, stop it. Light. Like you said, if you don't take out light, you cannot fight. The shy is now put himself in harm's way to make sure he can make a little bit of an impact. He's still staying alive, but only for so no. long. And light is carrying these fights. Weibo, it's all on Angel. We talked about it in game number three. Can he do if anything? If Zeri like that is allowed, then AP the Kaiser should be allowed as well. Angel, Kaiser we even had to hit her W to get her cool down lower. Season 12, Chan. No. The shy. I mean, I'll put them in the gauntlet, please. The gauntlet, please. Emergency sub in the gauntlet. The shy. Someone buy him. Loan him. All right. Smoke it up. Smoke the pack. Smoke it up. Come on. Come on. Rip bozo. Rip bozo. Weibo. The shy pack. Come on. Smoke it up. I believed all year long. I believed all year long. You can smoke it up now. I've had my moment. <laughs>